Would you like to see their paperwork from their previous purchase? Love to see their paperwork so that I know what I'm know it, what I'm about to approach myself. Into. Exactly. How do we get the paperwork? Uh, we take a look at the tray, but I can look at the paperwork in their glove box. It's usually going to be in there in an envelope. Right. I'll take a look and I'll see if they bought Gap, if they bought a warranty. Okay. And know what kind of what kind of buyer did I have? Okay. And if you want them to give it to you of their own free will, we use the hidden cash methodology. Mm -hmm. It sounds like this. Hey, Ryan, um, look, if you've got your paperwork in your glove compartment from your previous purchase, oftentimes I've helped my customers find hidden cash. What hidden cash is, is products that they purchased that are cancelable. It could help you a great deal with your down payment. Do you have that paperwork handy? Of course. Okay, then they'll give it to you. Um, vehicle service contract. Do you ask them if they have a vehicle service contract? Of course they do. Okay, ask me. Steve, do you have a vehicle service contract on this Infinity? Uh, Ryan, I do not. Oh, that's a shame. What do you mean? It's a shame that you don't have a vehicle contract, a vehicle service contract on there, because uh, oftentimes we can find some hidden cash that we can find as far as if we cancel the warranty, and it will help us back. You know, uh, as far as money down on the car deal. Okay. Mm -hmm. Or if there's a mechanical issue with your car that we have to repair, it will cause us to deduct from the value. But if you had a mechanical repair policy, it would pay for that repair. Yes. This is something you really should consider on your next purchase. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes. Okay. Um, ask me how many keys I have. Steve, how many keys do you have with your train? Brian, I got one. That's all it takes. Got one key? Yeah. Well, that's a shame. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? Um, you know, two keys is going to give us uh, a little bit more value in our train. Why is that? Because when the next person comes to buy the vehicle, they're going to want two keys with the vehicle. And keys are very expensive, aren't they? Man, you would not believe. These keys go anywhere from 400 to to $1,000 for a key in oh. programming. Okay, because they have computer chips in them. And it would be awesome if you had something that covered such a thing. Yeah. Might I have something that, like that with my, with my next car? I would. I would. I would <laughs> guarantee it. I would put it in right. <laughs> so I would have six months of key replacement, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Now, if you see that they, uh, the, the cosmetic wheel, uh, the wheels got road rash on it, you bring up cosmetic wheel. You're rarely going to find a dent or a uh, bent rim. So you want to bring up tire and road ha or tire and wheel road hazard somewhere else. Okay. It might be um, on the demonstration line. Okay. You're driving the Motor Trend vehicle, and you say, "Hey, by the way, um, you know." Have you ever hit anything in the road and blown a tire? If yes, they, they've got a frame reference. If no, say, well, a lot of people do. And one of the great things about the motor trend vehicles, it comes with tire and wheel road hazard coverage for six months. Okay? You blow out a tire, we'll pay for the tire. Zero deductible. You bend or break the wheel, we'll pay for the wheel. And by the way, a tire and wheel together on a car like this could run you eight to nine hundred dollars. We give you six months worth of coverage. Um, we pay for that, um, and you've got the ability to extend it if you so desire. Roadside assistance, I'm sure you know what that is. Hey, you run out of gas, um, you need a jump, you need a tow, we're going to give you six months of roadside assistance because it's a Motor Trend certified vehicle. And if you, if you see a chip in their windshield, bring up windshield repair. Yes, sir. Okay? Um, every one of those has got value if you can help the customer frame it right. Okay, now what are some of the other things on there? Explain the uh, <coughs> explain the oil change to me. 